Hello, my lovelies. So, welcome back to my video. So, as you can see from the title, we're talking about why going celibate is the best thing you can do as a woman if you don't have a relationship. And I mean like a serious relationship. So, why is going celibate the best thing you can do for yourself? is because when you practice well when you exchange and when you go into a intercourse with someone you give out a lot of your energy to a person right and that's why a lot of people after a one night stand or like a casual sexual relationship feel very empty inside because they have given a lot of their energy to someone who they don't really know you know they have nothing no connection to them they don't have or see a future with them so in the end what happens to a person who very frequently engages in casual sexual relationship a person ends up mentally sick with depression anxiety a lot of mental health issues maybe even end up getting a mental health problem that person never thought they had so that could also kind of a lot of people are born with you know genetically you know predisposal of like you know predisposal but whatever however you call it like they are genetically predisposed to a mental health condition and by doing reckless behaviors and casual sex is a way a form of a reckless behavior they kind of they like open up that mental health issue and it becomes very prominent for example borderline personality disorder is one of them so what do you why so yeah that's the reason why going celibate will benefit you so much so you know as you because this is why kind of comical i know because if you have watched me and you've seen my channel i actually got pregnant from a one night stand and yes i know maybe i'm not like 100 percent the right role model to talk about it but i haven't had any sexual relationship in over a year so like a year and six months and i feel the best that i've felt in a very long time I feel like a new person, I feel refreshed, I feel more innocent, more feminine and just I kept all my energy for myself and I know that any if I can do this anyone can do this as well you have to focus on yourself and don't look for other people to you know don't look for validation in other people validate yourself you are amazing and when you know that you are amazing, everyone else will also know you're amazing. So being celibate just is a very good thing for a woman. I don't know how it is for a man. I don't know if there are any benefits of being celibate for a man. For, from what I've, I know that it's not very good. Like because, I don't know, I, apparently causes cancer. I have no idea. But for a woman, it's very good. And also, I don't do any form of like self, like, you know, I don't do any masturbation or any of that because I just keep my energy, my sexual energy to myself. And I learn to, I'm learning to, you know, put it out, put it, put out my energy in other forms and to express myself in other forms and just to keep it for myself until I find that person. Uh, that is going to be serious with me and then I can give out all my energy to that person who really deserves it and he can enjoy my energy and you know but I'm not just gonna go out dress provoc provocatively and just get blackout drunk and find someone you know I'm not going to do that anymore I have been done that in the past and I'm telling you like it doesn't validate anyone like yeah you you know it doesn't lead to anywhere so i'm keeping all of that energy to myself and for a woman i think if she's not in a very committed serious relationship 
there's no reason for experimenting i feel like women we need more of some sort of connection with a person to be intimate with them and we need to find that connection un unless we are very drunk or we are under an influence of a drug then probably you know the those sort of you know that kind of changes the brain the chemistry in the brain